Hi everyone, Helen here. Today we are remembering that God made the animals and today we're thinking about the insects. Here are Sarah and Ada looking in their garden. Can you see the teeny tiny ants? In my garden I had some lovely bumblebees. Can you hear them buzzing? I wonder what insects you've got in your garden. Isn't it amazing to think that God made all the insects, including these beautiful bumblebees? Hello and welcome to our craft. Today we're going to be making Alex the spider, who is going to help us learn about God. First off, we're going to cut out around the edges of our paper plate. about this far in between. We're going to make this into a spider's web by adding some string. You're going to need to push one end into one of the holes and push it in at the other end. Just to make it secure, I've also got some sellotape so that you can stick down the ends. And here's our finished spider web. Now we're going to make our spider. We're going to make the spider legs out of some pipe cleaner and twist it round to keep it secure. You're going to need to separate out so you can see all of the legs like this. How many legs have we got? One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we're going to make some spider eyes. You can use googly eyes, or if you have a hole punch, you can use these little circles inside. Be very careful not to spill them everywhere though. You can take them and colour in the middles with a pen to make the pupils. Now I'm going to use some PVA glue to stick on the eyes. You've got to be really careful with this part and you might want an adult to help you. Did you know that most spiders actually have eight eyes? How cool is that? Ours only has two. And now with our lovely spider and web, we're going to finish off by writing that God made the in